Climate change is one of the defining issues of our time and our governments are putting policies in place to drive down harmful emissions. One of the high profile climate policies, in addition to the important policies to reduce emissions from things like buildings and transport, is to plant more trees. Our governments want to uh, create new woodlands in order to sequester or remove carbon from the atmosphere. This could be a really good thing, and we support woodland expansion if done in ways that also help nature. That means, for example, an expansion of native woodlands, like the ones that we manage at Inversnade. These could lock up carbon for the long term at the same time as allowing nature to flourish. But equally, woodland expansion could have its downsides. In the past, planting in the wrong places, like the flow country, have damaged important habitats and resulted in carbon emissions. Without a careful approach, we could see a rush to plant trees on sites like these that are important for nature, such as in places that are important for birds, like the curlew and the lapwing. So we've been working hard to try and think through how large changes in land use might happen and how we can seek to maximise the positive outcomes for both climate and nature whilst avoiding any negatives. So this work that we've been doing is just our initial exploration of some of these issues. We'll be going on to do more work in this area, but for now, We'd really like it if you would have a look at the storyboard we released recently and would be more than happy to talk with everyone and anyone about these important issues and what they mean for nature. We have a climate and nature emergency, so let's make sure that we move forward in a way that addresses both at the same time. <laughs>